RC McConley 8 here. What do we have here? I am in Gran Turismo Sport. What? I know you guys are like, dude, I watched your library video and you told me that this game completely sucks. And back then, I thought it did. I decided to give it a shot a year later because I've read some things about how they fixed this and they've made adjustments here and there's a bunch of downloads and they added a new car. So I'm like, you know what? Let's do it. Let's try it. And I have fallen in love with the Gran Turismo Sports series. <clears throat> I know, I know, I know. I, I should have given a shot back then. I, I don't know what I was thinking. I'm thinking because it was such a hyped up game. I'm thinking because I'm so used to the older games. I was such a Forza fan uh, and still am that I just expected more. And, you know, it didn't give me what I expected. And the online trying to to create a race and it was such a jumbled mess and they did a lot of fixing and I will give them props. They are continuously adding to this game and making it better and better as we go along. Um, I've been playing it for a little bit. You can see I have $1.4 million already and I'll, I'll show you my uh, my garage here to show you what I've, what I've accumulated. Now it works differently than, than the older Grand Trismos. Like back in the day, you used to win a series uh, and you'd get a car. And they don't really do it that way now. They do it by like driver miles. So each 24 hour period, if you accumulate 26 miles or 25 miles, you get a new car and it's random and it cycles through like four cars and you end up getting a car that um, is on one of them cycles. So uh, yeah, let's, let's see what I got here. I mean, I've got uh, the Audi TT, we've got a Mini Cooper. We've got a Fair Lady Z, um, the 908 HDMI Team, Peugeot, and I have a McLaren VGT. Um, let's see, uh, obviously I won that car, I won that car. I bought this car, bought this car. I think I won that car. I don't remember if I bought that one or not. I bought this one, the Porsche. I did buy the VW. Um, I won the the Coupen, or Copen, or however you pronounce that. Um, I won the R32, I bought the Roadster, I bought the Camaro, I won this Renault, I also won this Renault, I bought the Corvette, I bought the Supra, because I gotta have a Supra in my collection, um, I bought the Challenger, I bought this Mustang GT, I bought the Mazda, I bought the new Supra, because if I got the old Supra, I gotta have the new Supra, even though, you know, I don't know, I'm not... Driving it, I love it. Looking at it, I don't know if I'm sold yet. It, it's so different that ah, I, don't, I don't know if I like it yet. Uh, um, but I'm getting there. And more and more I see it, the more and more I drive it in the game, the more and more I like it. Um, here's my Ferrari F40. This has got to be in a collection of any car collector. You've got to have a Ferrari F40. Best car ever made, my opinion. Don't hate me. Um... M4 won. I won that. I won the... No, I take that back. I bought the F-150 Raptor. I won the Red Bull Junior Car. I won the Beetle Group 3. I won the Hybrid um, Race Car. I won the 4C. I won the Racing Cart. I won the Lancer. I won the Vantage. I bought... No, I won that Viper. Yes, I won that Viper. I won that. I won that. I won that. I bought the Huracan. I love the Huracan. That's like one of my favorite Mercedes or Mercedes. Listen to me. Um, Lamborghinis. <clears throat> I won the F-Type. I did I buy this one or did I win this one? I think I won that one. Yes, I won the R34. I won the Lancer. I bought the Subaru. I won the E-Type, I won the SLS 10, 2010, and I bought this Viper. And then here's another VW. I I ended up buying a VW because I was doing the VW series, and then I ended up winning it, which was like, really? But uh, yeah, there you go, guys. That's I mean, that's my collection. I mean, that's a bunch of cars. I, I mean, I've been playing a little bit, but it's accumulated over the hours of playing. Um, if we go back to the campaign... You can see that the, there's 100 races that I have completed in the GT series. Um, obviously, I did the schooling and, and went through and got my licenses to be able to race these races in the beginner league. There was 
I think they've added a few more races to these series too on the last update. As you can see, I've gotten that one cleared. This one has added two more races, so I could race them. Um, <clears throat> which is cool because, you know, in the older games, you race the series and that was it. They're adding, with this game, they're adding series to it, so that's why you don't win a car after your, you know, your series wins. They, they did it with this mileage thing. Uh, let's see. Did I finish? Yes, I finished that. Finished the Mazda. Finished the front wheel drive, rear motor class, or front motor rear wheel drive class, sorry. Um, Stars and Stripes, I finished that. I finished that. Check. There's the Beetle class, or the Beetle race that I uh, just did recently. It looks like everything in the beginner is completed. Up, oh, they added two to the mini. So I have two to the mini class that have been added, and I have two to the the FF challenge, front wheel, front engine. Um, Heritage, won that. The Z Heritage, I'm done. So beginner is pretty much done. I can go back and do some more races. Um, we have amateur, clubsman cup. Looks like I finished that one. TT, I've done that one. Four wheel, I did that one. Front engine, rear wheel drive completed. Boxer inspired. Now I have done one race to this one, and I have another race. You want to you, you do this race? Why not? We'll do this race. You guys can see how much of a shitty driver I am. Um, so, well, let's go with the Porsche. Why not? I think that's where the race I raced the first one. The car I raced the first one with. So we'll... Uh, We'll do it. We'll do this. You know, just step away from the baseball again. We'll we'll get into the driver's seat, do some driving. Um, I can't wait till I can get my um, simulator made. I want to build a a simulator for my racing games, for my NASCAR Heat, and my Gran Turismo stuff. I think that would be so much fun. Just don't have the funds. What it boils down to, right? The wife thinks there's more priorities than playing video games. Uh, I, don't, I don't understand that, but... <laughs> All right, let's see here. Let's get right into it. Let's, let's race. There's no waste of time here. <laughs> the one thing I don't like and I don't understand is why can't I qualify? Why? Why am I stuck in the middle or the back of the pack always? I don't like that. It drives me nuts that I can't qualify to help better me my position to start of this race. Clean pass there. Haven't done any online races either. But I do know that they are they are and can be very difficult because they go by your driver rating and all that, so Up to sixth. We only have four laps to get this win. Uh-oh, I drove way too hard into that one, guys. Way too hard, but I drifted it out. That's a professional driver right there. I don't have the perfect lines. But... I get the job done as we chase to the top of this pack here. Still feeling the car out a little bit. Don't want to drive too hard into these. Oh, past them on the inside. Two tires a little bit on the grass on that one, but it doesn't matter. We've got the horsepower and the speed to pull away. Uh-oh. Drove a little too hard into that. He's going to get it back. Dude, chill. 
I didn't ram you. I'm giving you space. Giving you space to race. Oh, I drove way too hard into that one again, guys. Way too hard. Keep it on the inside. Take the lead back as we come to the finish line. One lap down. All right, let's drive away from these fools. Big oopsie there, big oopsie. This is why I can't drive online because I make too many mistakes like that. Drive way too hard in the turns, brake too late, have to brake in the middle of a turn. We all know that's not gonna win races. I don't even know how I'm winning these races. Honestly, the only reason I'm winning these races is because I take my car and give it as much power as they allow me to get. That's how I win these races. Good lines, guys. Good lines. Probably could have drove through that a little faster. Yeah. Do I have traction control on? I do. You need to take that off. We need to take that off now. Let's see what kind of a driver I am without it. Oh, this is the one I drove hard into last time, and it didn't change this time. Hold it, girl. Hold it. With the traction control, I'm spinning. All right, well, no harm, no foul, right? Lost a lot of time. I still beat my best, my last lap with that goof up. Ooh! Thought I could do that one a little harder, but I apparently cannot. I'm trying to make up time, and you can see I'm making a lot of mistakes. You know, for 360, when I used to play Forza, feathering the feathering system for your for your throttle was decent. I always struggled with that. Um, this game is, oh my god, phenomenal. The feathering with the R1 and R2, or R2 and L2 for gas and brake, they, they did a phenomenal job with that. Now I can just give it a little bit of gas as I'm pressing down harder. It's, it's really nice. They did a really good job with that. I, I seem to have a lot of issues with the 360. Especially with cars that had extreme amount of horsepower, I could never get the feathering down correct. the GT3. It definitely, definitely nice car. I don't think anybody would agree, uh, disagree. <laughs> there we go. Here's our turns that we drove way too hard in last lap. Let's see if I do make the same mistakes. This was the one. This was the one. A little better. I don't tire squeal going in and out of that. 
Explore it to the finish line. Got one more lap. section not a bad section there too bad. Did a lot better than the first three laps, so let's see. Probably cut our time down considerably than that lap. Yeah, sure did. And we get to gold. The American in the Porsche gets the gold. So there you have it. I get 50,000 more credits. I earn 470 more mileage points. And, um, yeah, I mean, I just, it, it, it's a phenomenal game. I take, I retract my statement a year ago of how this was a waste of money. And on top of that, it's now a $20 game versus a $60 game. So it definitely cannot be beat. I mean, awesome. It's fun online now. I played a few friends in a, just a, a private little, um, server i didn't go online and race for professional points and all that i just did a little fun race thing a couple times and it was fun between that so uh <clears throat> i love the game awesome go out and get it it's addicting for me because i'm a creative person so with all the scapes that you can do the photo editing the all the designing of the cars you can do i mean it's great it's 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 awesome so i appreciate the likes i appreciate the views Keep hitting that subscribe button. Keep hitting the like button. And uh, hopefully we can get some more videos for you. And we'll see you on the next one. Thanks, man.